All right, so we're back here at Sweetgrass Spirits, and I'll tell you what I found that is just sitting on the shelf out here. Check this out. How cool is this? Just hanging out on the shelf. They only have three of them, and for that price, I had to pick up one. I really enjoyed coming here last time, speaking with Dan. He was very knowledgeable, very nice. Looks like they updated their labeling on this one right here a little bit. Is this a new label from them? Because it used to look like that. No. All right, so we just hopped out and stopped in Sweetgrass Spirits real quick to see if they had anything interesting. And you wouldn't believe it, but check this out right here for MSRP, no BS at all. Another one right here at Sweetgrass Spirits, just up the road. This right here was a great find, happy about it. I have now two of them, so I uh, really can't complain for how much? $69.99. 69. <laughs> Super cool, and on to the next one. Furman University, look right there on the side. I'll be damned. I'll be damned. Yeah, somebody's got this, uh, Someone's got this thing figured out where they're getting college's permission. Next you'll have a Gamecock one. Yeah, I know it. News release that A123, pretty sure. Yeah, that's the one, man. Yeah. That's the one everybody's uh, going after. You ever had the barrel proof? Mm -mm. But I've had Larceny barrel proof and I love it. I've had all three of those. Actually, yeah, last year, Larceny and, and Elijah's were like the top two barrel proof ones. Yeah. I had their one last year. I mean, it. It was pretty hot. Yeah. I mean, What's I it at? One, 125. I just picked up the Booker's Charlie's batch at 126.6. Oh, yeah. Yeah. How much are y'all charging for that? No, this. Oh, this guy? Um, yeah. 79.99. Yeah, I'm going to pick that up, too. Yeah. I tried a, a Booker's, I think it was a release from last year. Tennessee, uh, Kentucky Tea. It was, that was the last year's a weird, release. It had a weird name to it. Really? It might have been, been long enough. Customer brought me a sample of it, and it was my first time ever having bookers and guys. That's just really fun. So really? The 107 All right, picking up this guy and this one. Check that out. All right, so we just got out of Alchemist Spirits, and I'll tell you what, they had a really knowledgeable guy named Brandon. He was really helpful. And first up, we have the new Benchmark single barrel that just hit South Carolina, at least from what I'm told, and. Interesting, 95 proof, and uh, yeah, for 30 bucks, we'll see how that holds up. And then of course, with one of these bad boys right here, Elijah Craig Barrel Proof A123. So we'll see if this one holds up to all the hype. I know it is kind of allocated in a way and hoping to have a pleasant experience with my first Elijah Craig Barrel Proof. All right, so like a last minute thing that actually happened I had a buddy that was doing some hunting up in North Charleston and he called me and said, man, I know you've been looking for this. And of course, I had to have him grab it for me. So I don't have any footage of being in the store, but I will go to that store because the owner, he said was really cool and they had some pretty cool allocation. I finally found Maker's Mark 46 cast strength, which I've been looking for for a little while now. And I've been talking about a little bit on the channel. I love the Maker's Mark 46 with the French oak staves. It's just something about it and the Calf strength on this is bottled at 110.3 proof. So looking forward to doing a review on this. Stay tuned and I'll see you next time.